Hello and welcome back to the sideboard. I'm Ruben Bressler and I'm joined by Franz Florwinkel. Right? Yes. All yeah. right, I did yeah. it right. And uh, <laughs> he's a, a very famous magic card artist and I'm here to ask you some questions about some of your pieces. So um, you've been doing art for a very long time. Yeah. I, I assume since you were very young. My first card was 96. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. And uh, what? how did you get involved with Wizards of the Coast? Uh, how did that initially, how did that connection initially happen? Well, I started out doing board and card games, basically, in Germany mm -hmm. for German companies. And uh, I was working for Amigo Spiele back then. And it happened that Amigo got the uh, distribution for Magic back in... 94, 95, mm -hmm. I think, and um, since they were since since they were handling all the uh, organized play, all the tournaments, everything, they, they basically asked Wizards uh, for a German artist, oh, nice. and at That's the at the at the at the same at the same time, I was applying with my stuff uh, because I had met the art directors at the game show in Essen. Sure. So the really big one. Yeah, yeah. So, th so that that worked out well. Sure. Excellent. And now, of course, you live in the Seattle area. Yes. Which is why you're you're here, of course. Right. <laughs> um, and you've done a lot of of art for Magic, and you've got a lot of iconic pieces. Adds up with the years. Yeah. yeah sure. <laughs> and uh, and you're, you've continued like you've had some from a long time ago. You you, you were an artist in Odyssey and Torment a long time ago. Mm -hmm. But you've also got some new pieces yeah. like Ethereum Horn Sculptor, which we have here. Yeah. Um, Buried Ruin, which was in right. M12. Yep. You've also got some really iconic pieces. One one that stuck out to me when I was looking at the search was your Snow Covered Island. Yeah. From Cold Snap, which is very iconic. Oh. Uh, as well as Fire Ice. You did okay. both Fire and yes. Ice. Yes. Uh, no, 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 oh, no, no. You only uh, did one? Uh, I, did, I did only ice. You only did ice. And oh, that was a, a fire okay. was done by David Martin. Oh, okay. And actually, I, I, I had one signing with him together, uh, but that's long, long time, time ago. ago. Sure. But, um, yeah, I still have people asking me if, um, how if to get a hold of him. Oh, right? okay. Oh, how to get yeah. a hold of him. Cause he yeah, go to because, the because they all have those half-signed right, cards. Right, right, right. <laughs> right. Yeah, no, that was a... That was special, yeah. somehow. It's um, uh, it's I don't I don't know why people have latched onto that card so much, but they certainly have, and it's very. Um, well, it's it's usually the cards that are really well for the gameplay. Sure. So I and guess I guess which, I guess this is this is an awesome card to play. Right, and uh, and speaking of which, you are also the artist for Oblivion Ring, the new one. Yeah. And not the original lore one, of course. The new one nope. with the guy that's kind of doing this. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, and Glacial Fortress. Right. Which I actually got you to sign for me. Let's ah. See if I can pull it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Got you to sign and put a little dragon on, so you guys can see that. Um, and I, I really appreciate that. That's pretty great. Um, so do do you have a preference? Do you care if a card sees more play? Or do you just like the art for the art? And I mean, or is it like if, if if you're really proud of a piece of art, you wish it saw more play? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I mean, I like the art for the art, obviously. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but I also think it's 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 great if 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 it's a good card uh, and um, it, it it helps with it helps with, with because more art. people yeah, ask you to sign yeah. it and stuff like that. Yeah. Sure. What's the what's your uh, what's your favorite piece that you think you've done? Hmm, that's hard to Tough tell. Right. But, um, Didn't mean to put you on it's, the spot it's, like it that. Is my, um, usually I say it's the one that I'm working on. Right. <laughs> but uh, I think, uh, yeah, a Time Sieve would be one of my Time a great personal one. favorites. Yes. You're, you're also and, sort of... And, and the Magus of the Moon, of course. <laughs> yes. And now yeah. you did Blood Moon and Magus of the Moon. Yes. And you also did, uh, you, you sort of got, got this uh, you, this nickname now of being the Time Guy. And you've done Time Sieve ah. and Temporal Mastery. I, I, that's the first time I hear about that. That's the first time you've heard that? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm the Time Guy. The Master of I Time like, and Space. I, li I like that. <laughs> there you go. So um, that's, that's a new thing that you have in your back pocket. You think that you're going to get uh, more stuff like that in the future where oh we need to break I, I, down the I, time barrier I, I hope so i hope so that Excellent. would be that would be fun nice yeah and so you were mentioning also that you do art for board games and yes. other types of games we yeah. have a piece right here right from a, a, a board game of some kind mm -hmm. or uh, well uh, this is actually um uh, 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 this is how a jigsaw puzzle looks oh okay uh, put before, together before it's cut sure so um 
the nice uh, part about this was they, they they just told me you know we need some fantasy puzzles do something do something excellent <laughs> nice I really like that yeah cool. no but I also I also do uh, board and card games regular stuff European games okay. what kind um, of what kind of stuff can people find you on working on? oh um, I just got two new games released in um, Essen that's yeah. the, the big show in Germany um, that the one was the new Hans and Glück game Carrara and the second one was uh, from Eckert Spiele Yedo it's, uh, that's, a, that's, a, that's a really cool game about ancient Japan oh cool so if, if people want to find you online if they want to purchase items from you or get you signed or see where you're going to be showing where can yeah. they find you I have a I have a website of course it's a little outdated because I'm trying to um, uh, get a new one soon but uh, that is like two years uh, mm -hmm. ago so it's it's www.france-fovinkel.com okay and uh, I sign cards all the time people can just send them to me and if they have a a self-addressed envelope um, included so I can yep. send it back that that's usually enough I do it all the time no Excellent. problem yeah. well thank you so much for joining me in the sideboard sure. thank you very much yeah.